As you know, uh, in this day and age of uh, the uh, spread of the internet, uh, it's to do with, uh, on, 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 on cybercrime, it's to do with uh, hacking, on spying, on uh, pedophilia, and all these other things that are going on in the internet. And I think uh, governments and countries need to take steps to legislate for uh, cybersecurity. I think uh, for countries like Solomon Islands, and indeed the countries in the Pacific, I think it is to do with fraud, money laundering, uh, trafficking of uh, people, especially children, uh, women and girls, and uh, basically uh, the uh, uh, sex uh, trafficking that is going on. So it's very important. I think as uh, legislators, uh, we need to be aware uh, of what is happening in uh, cybersecurity and cybercrime and uh, implement uh, and advocate for legislation uh, for cybersecurity. At the moment, uh, there are no legislations that are enacted by our parliament for cybersecurity, nor are there any regulations uh, in place uh, for uh, cybersecurity or cybercrime. So this is a whole new area for us, and I'm very thankful that uh, uh, we are here in this workshop to learn and to indeed urgently come up with uh, steps to make legislation. I think the, 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 uh, uh, the learning uh, outcome for me in this workshop is uh, where to start, where to start uh, in uh, coming up with legislation for cybercrime and cybersecurity.